Like this, this might be untoppable. I mean, well, we get the kingdom. We definitely gonna top that, but for, for humans, that's that's nigga right there. Oh, that guy? <laughs> oh, he looks fucked up. <laughs> <laughs> that's the nigga who claims the 13 tribes of Judah. <laughs> 13 tribes of Judah. <laughs> he got the number wrong and the motherfucking tribe, bro. The nation wrong. He got the number wrong and the nation. First of all, in the Revelations, there's no 13 tribes. There's 12 tribes. And it's not I thought Judah. it was one tribe. That's Revelations. Judah, Judah's one tribe. 12,000 out of each tribe is 144,000. And he told, he told me to study, man. Is that a sword in his hand? That's not a sword. Now let him, <laughs> let him go. Pocket, that's a pocket knife, man. That's a pocket knife. Yeah, hella demons on him. Um, I, I sit a queen, I sit a queen, and am no widow, and shall see no sorrow. Right, that's what America says. I sit a queen, but this is a queendom. I see, I'm, I will be no widow. Basically, I won't lose lose anybody, won't lose any forefathers, won't lose any wars. Therefore shall her plagues come in one day, <laughs> death one, and mourning. One day you're gonna be white, man, one day. What's it saying, scripture, one hour? Actually, it's gonna, uh, well, it says one hour, it's gonna wipe this shit. Revelations. Yeah, yeah one hour. Not 60 one, minutes. Not only one day, but 60 minutes, this shit gonna get wiped. From sea to shining sea. <laughs> Crazy. You seen that song Grammar School, right? <laughs> Word. Yo, and I always knew something was wrong with that pleasure of the <laughs> I like, I stopped. He used to never want to get up and do it. Word, I used to keep my hat on, <laughs> sit down. Yo, shit you feel, like, I feel, you, you feel like Uncle Tom and yeah, shit. Yeah, I, I felt so, you're like, I ain't had no knowledge. But I, my spirit was like, nigga, chill. No fuck <laughs> yeah. shit, It's not for you. Oh, man. <laughs> Therefore shall her place come in one day. Right. Death and mourning and famine. Yeah. And she shall be early burned with fire. That's the that's, that's all that nuclear missile talk. This is a different scripture. The, the other scripture didn't say nothing. It just said, you know, brighten the arrow, shoot the arrows. But it didn't say nothing about being burnt with fire. This one is describing the same thing, but it's saying being burnt with fire. That's these nuclear missiles, man. These scriptures add up so perfectly, man. It's crazy. So perfect. New Testament Christian. Right, yeah, man, they're crazy. So perfectly, man. This place is going to be pelted and melted. It's like uh, Peter said, man. It's going to uh, melt with fervent heat. All the elements shall melt, man. It's not gonna be no. I had, oh, this, oh, I was in the barbershop. They talking about yo. How you think the earth going to end? It's go, I think the sun. I think the earth is going to go up into the sun. I'm like, why you think that? And I tried to tell him, and he was bucking up. Like, nah, it ain't no mystery. I'm like, all right, old oh, head. Yeah, everybody got everybody got an opinion. There's only one fact though. Everybody got some magic yo, ass, so wait, magical conclusion. He, he rather believe that stupid ass <laughs> shit. The earth is going to levitate in the sun. Real mysteries. <laughs> <laughs> Everybody got some That's pointed right now over here. Everybody got some magical conclusion, yo, over, over this, some real shit, yo. It's Toys R Us, man. Toys R Us kids. Yeah. Crazy niggas, man. For, for strong is the Lord God who judges her. Right. And the kings of the earth who have committed fornication and live deliciously with her shall bewail her and right. lament her right. for her. They're going to be mad, man. They're going to be sad. Why? Because they can't make no fucking money off this place no more. It's like you fucked the money up. We like That's how you know. It's not going to be That's how you know the Lord <coughs> put his spirit on them. Because if it was up to the other nations, they would keep America going because they get money off it. But the Lord going to pour his spirit on them to go to war. They're not, they can't even control what they doing, man. The yeah, Lord, yeah, 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 yeah. Like, they can't. They, it's like, <laughs> like you know, you ever got mad? You're like, I don't know what came over me. Yeah, that's, that's what's gonna happen to them, yo. They not gonna. Like, Why did I shoot those missiles? <laughs> <laughs> they coming. <laughs> you know what I mean? They not gonna know, man. The Lord gonna take over. It's crazy. What? <laughs> when they shall see the smoke of her burning, hmm. standing afar off for the fear of her torment, saying, Alas, alas. The great city Babylon, that mighty city, for one hour is thy judgment oh, come. There it is. One hour, yeah, that's, that's what right. I was looking for right there. And one hour has 
American judgment come. Right. In the merchants of the earth shall weep and mourn over her. Over her. The merchants shall weep and mourn, man. All these people who make money off this place shall weep and mourn. For no man buyeth her mer merchandise anymore. Right, no more Jordans from China for you, for you niggas. No, no more, more LeBron James. Teeth. No more LeBron James from China. No more white teeth from Pakistanis. All that shit is over, and they're gonna be mad, man. The merchandise of gold and silver and precious stones. Oh yeah, no more uh, jewelry exchange from them so-called Jews and them, yeah, them so-called you know. Arabs making killings off of blood diamonds and all that shit. That's over. And of pearls and of fine linen and purple and silk and scarlet and all thine wood and all manner vessels of ivory and all manner vessels of most precious wood and of brass and iron and marble and cinnamon and odors and ornaments and frankincense and wine and oil and fine flour and wheat and beasts and sheep and horses and chariots and slaves and souls and of men. slaves and souls of men. All of that is merchandise that was bought over here, man. Including, let me see that, you know, that's how I flip it over. You was, you was fucking, you, you was an import export black man. Still is. Still is, man. First you was a slave, now they buying your soul. Stupid. That's Babylon, man. We reading about America right out the Bible. For you simpletons. I can't get who want to see the word America in the Bible. Why you got to see the word America in the Bible? If it's describing a future place, and it's describing America to a T, why you need to see the word America? And the fruits of, the fruits that thy soul lusted after are departed from thee, and all things which were dainty, dainty and goodly are departed from thee, and thou shalt find them no more at all. Mm -hmm. The oh. word, the merchants of these things, which made, which were made rich by her, and shall stand afar off for the fear of her torment, Son weeping and wailing, Son and Son saying, "Alas, alas, yeah. that great city that was clothed in fine linen and purple and scarlet and decked with gold and precious stones and pearls, for in one hour so great riches come to naught, to naught, and nothing, over." And every shipmaster and all the companies and ships and sailors. Shipmasters, imports, exports. And, and as many as traded by sea stood afar off. I told you, America gets 40% of its income through imports and exports. The other 60 to 65% come from them taxing your ass. And them ships gonna be trying to get to America and stop dead in the middle of the ocean looking at this destruction. You know? <laughs> <laughs> like, damn. They gonna be in denial, like, yo, we got this work there. I don't care about no war. They might get swallowed up, yeah. yeah. Like, the whole earth's gonna they shake. They gonna get swallowed up. Shit going, it's going so crazy. The that whole earth gonna oh shake. We read that God. last week, uh, Isaiah 24 and 19. Yeah. It said what, like a... Uh, like a, a drunkard. Drunken? Yeah, a drunkard. <laughs> it's gonna be removed like a cottage. Crazy, man. Crazy. Oh, that's what the nigga said. It's gonna be an earthquake. It's gonna knock it off the axis. It's just gonna oh, spin it to the side. <laughs> that's not a modal technique shit. Yeah. Too much modal technique. What are you hold on to pole? Ah! Yeah. I don't know what we gonna do. <laughs> I can't even think. I can't even think about that shit. That shit harder to think about. Like nigga, I can I can think about the scriptures more than that. <laughs> and cried and cried when they saw the smoke of her burning, saying. What city is like unto this great city? Right, what city is like America? There is no, there is no, there is, there's no other country where people standing outside of Best Buy at, what time these niggas start? At, at 12 in the morning, 12 a.m.? Yeah. There's nobody waiting outside for 10, doing a 10 hour shift to buy some sneakers or a CD. There's no other place, yo. Know? Which, which, which city is like this? That's what they saying. And they, and they shall cast dust on their heads and cry, weeping and wailing, saying, Alas, alas, that great city wherein were made rich, all that had ships in the sea by reason of her costliness, for in one hour is she made desolate. The scriptures keep reading. Re, uh, Re one hour, what? Yeah. That's the third time it said, in one hour, this shit is gone. Rejoice over her, thou heaven, and ye holy apostles and prophets, for God hath avenged you on her. Ooh. Read that again. 
18 to 20. Rejoice over her, thou heaven, and ye holy apostles and prophets. For, for God has avenged you on her. Right, man. That's that's what it's all about. The Lord is doing this for us, man. For for the for the ones way, way before us. To the, for the ones of us doing this now, man, to the, to the true believers, to the, to the ones with the real faith, man, the real faith, the, the one-thirds, the elect, and like I said, the, the, the throwback prophets. <laughs> and a mighty angel took up a stone like a great millstone and cast it into the sea, saying, Thus, with violence shall that great city Babylon be thrown down and shall be found no more at all. Right. And the voice of harpers and musicians and pipers and trumpeters oh, yeah, shall be question, heard no more. You got a question, brother? Mm -hmm. You got a question? What, what, what is this all about? Well, we out here tell our people that we are the 12 lost tribes of Israel from the black man, the Negro, is the tribe of Judah, West Indians, the tribe of Benjamin, all the way down to the Spanish, the Native American Indians. And flip that over. And we letting them know their heritage, their, our, our history, our heritage, our customs, and so on and so forth. We're coming out the truth of the Bible. Like this, I saw you look at this, I think this is the sign that caught your attention. It says, this is the devil, this image is not biblical. It's not, you can't read nowhere in the Bible that he looks like that. And that's a, a big lie that a lot of our people believe. That's just, that's just the image that they want us to see, you feel? Exactly, that, that's what we out here to you wake know? people up. And we got this, it says Jesus is a Negro, not a white man, because the Bible describes him as a Negro. And the, and the Bible also tells you that the Negro is the true Jew. And these, these scriptures, Revelation 1, 13, Daniel 10, 5, Jeremiah 14, 2, Isaiah 29, 22, those are backup scriptures to let you know what the Jews, the true Jews look like and what Jesus Christ looks like. That's where we are. We're just out here to get all the lies out of here and bring all the truth in, man. And we out here to prophesy the downfall of America, too, because America's right. going down, and we're not scared to say it. It's going to happen. <laughs> How's it going to go down? Oh, through nuclear missiles. That's it. It's going to be World War III very soon. I don't know if you watch the news, but it's going down. No. The thing, well, the thing I don't like, you got a white man on TV telling us it's going to rain, Oh. Snow and all that bullshit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, you know, God controls that, man. He, he wants to be God, though. Case in point. And then, and then, and then they God. got, and then they got these movies out here talking about the world's gonna end. Nobody knows that except God. You feel me? Yeah, but He put the signs in the scriptures, and that's that's what we out here. Uh, I believe the world's in Revelations right now. That's, the, that's what we read right, right, right now. Revelation, yeah. Revelation too. But. He put the signs out here, and we watch the news, and we read the signs in the scriptures. And that's what we out here doing, teaching about the signs, telling, telling the black man, the Spanish man, that we are one. We need to come back together to the Most High God, and how we can escape that punishment. Now, 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 see, we as black people, we got the Bloods, the Crips. We fighting and killing each other. That's that's. Why don't you why don't you take cool. didn't you take that take that what you get and and bring it together and do something for the do that's something curses. for you. Those are curses. Yeah, but it tells you the scriptures why that happened. You know, but see, I, I believe that you know the government they show us the cops. That's the game. Oh, yeah. They show us the military. That's the game. You know what I'm saying? So they get mad when we form our game. Yeah. You know? They don't want us to come together. This is the real nation right here, though. But yeah, that's what's going to unite us. That's what. Brown. This is the true. This is the real game. Native American Indians. The black man and, and the Hispanic man, we all want. That, that's the real game. And the most high God is the leader. That, that's what we out here teach. You know? And, and righteousness. That's the real mafia. Yeah, true. What you got? You got something? I was gonna bring out when you were talking about the game. Oh, go ahead. You said it was gonna rain. Now it's gonna rain right now. <laughs> I ain't got it yet. So oh, oh, you ain't got it? Nah, I mean. It's gonna do the wrong That's over. Yeah, I'm in the The curses, yeah. The oh, yeah shall be like like we said, that was a curse. Like, we, our people, you know you know about the um, Moses? Yeah. You know, he did 40 days and 40 nights with God, and God gave him the Ten Commandments and yeah. all that. Well, he gave those law, statutes, and commandments to the Israelites. And through research and studying, he found out that our people are the true biblical Israelites. And we were given those law, statutes, and commandments. 
and we broke those. But since we broke those, you know, you know, niggas is hard headed and get rebellious and crazy and want to do what they want to do. Since we broke those, the Lord put curses on us. He made us slaves. He made us children of the ghetto. He made our, our women crazy towards us. He made us crazy towards each other. That's why. Brothers see each other in the street instead of saying hi, how you doing? My name is. They just ice cream each other. I said, what the fuck you looking at? Let me. Right, right, crazy, right, right. Yeah, they that's why we be grilling, looking mean, all that. Crazy, man. It's, it's crazy. <laughs> it makes me sick. Like and then like we gotta buy our clothes from the white man. We gotta get our water, our food. You know what I mean, everything we want gotta come from our enemy. Basically, if we want borrow money, we gotta go to him. These are all curses. Like other, like you see the Chinese man. He set up. He'll have a Chinese store in the hood. And cake up, yeah. and he's not. He don't come here struggling. He make money. The Arab man, he, gas station, liquor store, cake up. You know what I mean, we the only people who have trouble because we under these curses, and that's another curse because it tells you that the stranger amongst you will get higher than you. Meaning, like Chinese man, Arab man, any man, they don't live in your neighborhood. They just got stores in your neighborhood, and they're getting very high over you. They take all the money out the community and send it back to their country or help their kids out, you know what I mean? These are all curses. That's what we out here teaching our people that we, we got to follow the laws, statutes, commandments of the Most High God, keep the faith, and you know, these curses will be lifted off one day. And if you notice, those other nations, when they come over here, they ain't stuck in the projects. Who's filled the jails? We do. We fill the jails, oh, yeah. we in the projects. Right. Now, Black, why Latin, is that? A majority people in prison. Some, some some brothers and Latinos in there for innocent crimes. Yeah, exactly. And, and exactly. some bullshit, you know. Exactly. I, I'm, I make music myself. I, right. I, I support everybody, man. If I can say this, you know, some of the nations coming over here. Like, we go try to get a loan or something, they tell us, well, we got bad credit or no credit. Yeah. These people come over here with a right. name in America, and they get loans to open up businesses. Right. Yeah. That's, just don't make no That's systematically anymore. designed yeah. by the higher-ups. The Rothschilds, the elite bankers. Yeah, right we as black people, we, we gotta come up, man. We all gonna come up. We gotta, we gotta come up because they, they try to forget about us, man. Yeah. You know? But they can't stop us, man. Go back to Revelation? Yeah, man. 20, Revelation 18 to 22. And the voice of harpers and musicians and the pipers and the trumpeters shall be heard no more at all in thee. And right. no craftsman of whatsoever craft he be shall be found any more in thee. And that day when America destroyed all that, all the music, all the all the craft, craft, crafty people who will grade their craft, all that's gonna be out of here. This land's gonna be desolate. Nobody's gonna live here. You heard you heard of Babylon the Great? Yeah, well. So what 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 happens? What, what happens to somebody trying to come up in, in, in the music industry? There's going to be no more music, no more rapping. Well, when America is short, it's over. It's right now. It's right now. We're going to have music. In my opinion, 99% of the rap game is ran by the devil. Except the one. Oh, the Jewish, yeah. The Fake Jews, yeah. yeah. So you look at it, they talk about bitches, hoes, money, drugs. That's what they talk about. Guns. Nobody talk about nothing. They ain't talk about real shit because they like to program our people to be stupefied and dumb. Yeah. They like that shit. They don't put a conscious rap. Like, you don't hear dudes like Common no more, even though he's uh, bugged out his yeah, mind. I'm Talib uh, Kweli, dudes like Talib that, you don't Kweli. hear him. A mortal yeah. technique, you don't really hear no more. They shut his ass down. They, they, he's a sellout they, anyway. You got you to gotta jump through hoops to hear that music. I mean, they don't go on the radio. Yo. But no, with this, this, this is about Babylon the Great. When you read Babylon the Great is America. And one day, very soon, when this place is going to be wiped out. And it's, it's basically saying, ain't going to be no more music coming out of here. Because, you know, the most popular music comes from America. This shit, you got rappers in Japan. These people don't even speak English and they yep. these lyrics. But you see, it's not, now see, this is, the, this is where the shit gets twisted. What? Black music, mm -hmm. you know, you look, at, you look at all the greats that passed on. Who's the number one audience that's buying the CDs? White people, yeah. you know? Definitely. Definitely. But that's cool. A lot of people burn them. We, we're these nations justice. That's all we are. We're entertainment. Yeah, we, we, we rule the sports they, world, everything. That's they, us, our people. We entertain the whole world. And we trapped in America. We, we deserve Everything all about this world being hell and we don't even know it? No, this we do know. This is hell. <laughs> we do know. This is hell. Yeah. That's right. right. This ain't heaven. <laughs> <laughs> this is hell. Well, this is hell. And no, it's especially hell for us. Like I said, we, we got it the worst, man. We in, a, we in the richest country in the world. And we're doing the worst. That's hell. Yeah. Like, I, like I said, these other nations come over here 
can't speak no English, they get rich. They don't vote. They don't care who president is. China got a Chinese people got Chinatown in DC. They got Chinatown in New York. I'm sure they got one in LA. So funny. They got they got Chinatown wherever the fuck they wanna go. They don't vote. You know what I mean? They just get they just get the money. But our people, we stuck, man. We stuck in a mindset and we stuck in hell. Like you don't see in uh little Italy, Netherlands, little uh, China. Uh, 2012 vote signs all over the place. You only see that in the hood. Cause they want to big one. Us to uh, believe that we got some kind of power that uh, we got to put somebody off. And get involved, man. They want they want us to, to believe in them, depend on them. Like in the scriptures, it tells you it's a sin to vote for for another name. Like all right, what we black like people, right? Why should we want a white person to vote? You should want your own kind to be guiding your people. And that's a that's a that's a law and in, in our so we, we don't vote. That would be a sin to put George Bush over us or John Kerry over us. We want G, we want the one in the world called Jesus Christ over us. That's our king. He never stopped being our king. So that that the so called black that's what, coming that's back. That's what we out here pushing in a nutshell, brother. We out here telling our people who king is, who we are, what the future is, who our God is. This is uh, Isaiah 10 and 1. Woe unto them that decree unrighteous decrees and that they, and that right grievousness which they have prescribed. Right, uh, unrighteous decree. What, what's some unrighteous? Fucking uh, gay tickets, rights. Gay, oh, rights, gay rights, women uh, over men, abortions. Yeah, abortions. Like all, all these unrighteous decrees. Divorces. <laughs> okay, let's keep going and going. Yeah, and they, they, they put it out. Yeah, and we, yeah, we voted for that's what we vote for. We vote. We basically vote for gay rights. We vote for uh, more, 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 more drama. Yeah, that's Obama what? just said that he approves gay rights. Jay Z too backed it up. Oh yeah, Jay, Jay. And that's Jay, what God. Love Obama, Jay you know, Obama out. Love and God Obama. destroyed Saddam and Gomorrah. It was Jay, five. Jay, Jay, I believe Jay Z is all of them are. For you to be in that level, even MC Hammer said it. Like, they exposed us as to be in that level. Like, like Tupac even said it with uh, with Quincy Jones. He said Quincy Jones told him no, he wanted to take him to the director's couch, no, no. which means what? He, he, he said Quincy no, Jones no, wanted to have no, sex no, with no. him. You said Tupac. I'm, I'm going to show y'all brother something. Nah, you know about Quincy though, right? Quincy ain't no good, y'all. Quincy Russell Jones? Simmons. Uh, uh, they, Pim all, C, they all corrupt. Pim C came out and said Russell Simmons is a fag, which everybody knows anyway. And he was calling people out. He said Mace got caught with, with a boy, I think in Atlanta. Mason Bethel? Pim, yeah, I think it was him. Mace was, I mean, Pim C was just calling people out. And he said, wait till I get the next interview. You're going to really be shocked. And all of a sudden, they found him dead in the hotel. Yeah. Come on, man. Anybody, anybody that speaks some type of truth, they just take him out. But they want to they wanna push their agenda. They don't want that. Manny Pacquiao, he said, faggot shall be put to death. Leviticus 2013. Look at his eyes. And he look at mine. Are you related to him? I feel, I feel that, yes. Hey, that's your brother, man. He's, he's an Israelite. You're an Israelite, so we all brothers. <laughs> We're related. We brothers. See, the thing that throws me off a bit. See, my, my birth name, my birth given name was Ricky Pay Williams. You know, his his mother, Phoenix Court, that's not his real name. Her real birth name is Alex Faye Williams. Mm -hmm. Now, you see, sometimes when I write music, his spirit comes out. If I told that to anybody else, they would, they would want to throw me in chains and institution. I believe in reincarnation. Believe Reincarnation's in the scriptures. Yeah. Yeah, reincarnation's in the scriptures. Look at that So, be, uh... Let me say one thing too, about that real quick. I, I give it one thing, at least Tupac, at least, look, he sold out, but at least he had a conscience. Cause they wanted him to make music about killing his own people. He wanted to get into politics. He really cared about his people. He wasn't like Jay-Z. Jay-Z just kept going and going and going. If Tupac would've did what, he would've kept going with the Illuminati's agenda, he would've been a demigod right now. And Biggie wanted to come out with a clothing line called 666. So Biggie was no good. That's why the most high took both of them out. But Tupac at least had a conscience, I give him that. He was he could have been a demigod right now. If he would have been down with the agenda, he man, but he's good now, he's in the spirit world. He might come back with the Lord with a sword in his hand. He knows the truth now. This is Revelation 18 and 22. You done with that? Yeah. Revelation 22 and 18. And the voice of harpers and musicians in the pain. Revelation 18 and 22. And the voice of harpers and musicians and of pipers and of trumpeters shall be heard no more at all in thee. And no craftsman of whatever craft, whatsoever craft he be, shall be found any more in thee. <clears throat>
and the sound of the millstone shall be heard no more at all in thee. And the light of a candle shall shine no more at all in thee. And the voice of the bridegroom and of the bride shall be heard no more at all in thee. And thy merchants were the great men of the earth, for by her sorceries were all nations deceived. And in her was found the blood of prophets and of saints and of all that was slain upon the earth. Right, because a lot of Israelites, you so-called black and Hispanic men, die over here, man. Through, through, basically through slavery. You could have you you could have been a you could have been a priest you could have been a prophet but you didn't have they, first of all they didn't let you read the Bible you got you would they kill you for reading the Bible they, they wouldn't even let you read you know what I mean so he the, uh, the so-called white man took out a lot of our people man that's why America's so cursed because yeah. a lot of our, our people's bones are on the, the Native American Indians right. the tribe of Gad yeah. our people they're right they here man buried them wrong they buried them they, wrong. They, hung people for longer than they should be They killed our babies in yeah. the islands that's too, nothing. Puerto Rico every and all time, that. Every time we get abortions, that's a future, that's a future king, man. That's a future prophet. Like you, you, you like giving him no chance to do what he put on this earth to do. That's it. Uh, Psalms 22, 62 and 10. Trust not in oppression and become not vain in robbery. If riches increase, set not your heart upon them. Right. Trust not in oppression, man. And a lot of our people trust in America, man. This place is nothing but oppression. A lot of our people, they believe in that it's a dog eat dog world. They're not they're not team players. I mean they only care about themselves. They don't care about, you know, how their people I'm doing fine. I mean they don't care about their their nation as a whole. I mean I yo, lady, I not lady, but I always hear people, I hate black people, I hate it'll be a nigga saying it, like I hate niggas, you know what I mean? Like a lot of people don't really care for their people, man. They just they just out for themselves. There's a lot of people out there. Yo, I, I just can't wait to be around white people. And you got a lot of entertainers. I, all I need is for the Jews to accept me. You know what I mean, like a lot of people be making these so-called jokes, but you know there's some truth in it. You know what P. I mean? P. Diddy said that in that song. Uh, he said, I'm making that white folk money, some shit oh, like yeah, that, some yeah, stupid yeah. shit. But he ain't making no white folk money. Because the real Illuminati, Rob Child, they were yeah, trillionaires. Yeah. They're 900 trillionaires, man. They're trillionaires. Yeah, What's man, next after man, trillion? Kazillion? Those motherfuckers got money, and you'll never see them on TV, man. They're behind the curtains, man. You can't even spend a trillion. We're going to crush them dudes when he comes back, yo. All right. How else are we gonna take this man down? We can't even get together. We could have taken him down before when we was in shape. I want Jay Z. I, 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 I want. I'm not, not not like sexually, but I, I, want, I want. I want to battle him. I want to rip him to shreds, dog. No, we're gonna we're gonna rip him to shreds. We're gonna we're gonna chop him up. <laughs> he might be in the wilderness, Jay Z. Jay Z got to get a special death. He got to get a special death. He can't just die in the missiles, man. He might just be in the wilderness and might have to deal with the Lord right there. Lord knows Him, Lil Wayne, all of them. Because now they're... I know Beyonce is wicked to the... Oh, yeah. And uh, Kanye, he, he, he openly admits he sold his soul to them. Yeah. He tried to find Lil B said that too, that demon. He said it. I got, I'm possessed by demons. Gay guy? The guy yeah. The about the gay album? He said, I'm possessed by demons. These dudes actually do satanic shit. They sacrifice little kids, they have sex with each other. Because the more wickedness you do, Satan gives you gifts too. Yeah. So you open up your booty hole, the, high, the highest point of witchcraft is to have sex with little boys. That's the highest point of witchcraft. It's like, it's like you do right by God, he does for you. You do right by Satan, he does for you. But the thing about Satan is, at the end of the day, he says, fuck you, and he jumps off yeah, you, yeah. and then you get jacked up. The Lord, whatever he gives you is forever, man. That's why the kingdom of heaven is going to be forever. You have DMX. I got a scripture back. I'm oh, sorry. That was one more thing. Trust and oppression and oh, riches. What do you say about riches? Uh, Psalm 62 and 10. <clears throat> Trust not in oppression and become not vain in robbery. And if riches increase, set not your heart upon them. Right, man. All that, uh, all that money, 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 man. Whatever, man. Keep, keep God first, man. Money ain't everything. It's not. But the people you think can't. Yeah, say. The scripture said it's a defense. Easier said than done, man. Money is the root of all evil. Not the love of money. The love of money. Because the scripture said money's a defense. You're supposed to have money. It's common sense. Yeah. You wash your ass, go to work. Yeah. You know what I mean? You don't need money, but it's not the love of money, yo. Yeah, like, you got people out there that just greedy, man. Just greedy. Take everything. Like, so cool, right, man? He wants it all, man. Like, they, like these drugs, they had, they, you know, the doctors, they got all of us. We're now here on all these anti-psychotics. Anti yeah, 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 yeah. All yeah. these drugs. 
You look at the weed, the coke, the crack. Yo. Yep. All products of the devil. Yo. Yep. Oh yeah. And I'll be honest with y'all, bros. I used to do that shit, but I cleanse my body. I don't do it. Yeah, you got real born again. Intentional on doing it. You know. And, and real money. That shit turns into like your God, man. It's dependent. Like you need it to keep going, to live. You, you love the feeling. You, you need the feeling more and more. I mean, and that's not good. You say he's smoking every day. He doesn't know how it feels not to be hot. Yeah, man, that's like a party. Uh, how much money he got? He, he was broke. And to, and to go back to the money thing, real money is gold and silver. That's real money. That, that's real money. Paper, that shit that we got is just paper. And God is going to destroy this shit because the economy collapse is going to happen. And when the dollar collapses, all hell is going to break loose. And that's in the scriptures. You know about the dollar dropping, right? The, 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 the value of a dollar. Is, the, yeah. drop, that's why the price of everything is going up because the value of the dollar is going down. So it takes more dollars. To get that product now. I mean, that's why gas is crazy. Cause them errors like, well, yo, uh, when did it, who tried to get rid of the um American currency? K Gaddafi. Yeah, yeah. That's why they killed yeah. Gaddafi. Cause that he was, was trying to he was trying to do away with the uh with the American currency, the dollar, and he was trying to put the dinar back in, in the system. That's why if you look at it, it's, it's hard to find. I'm not sure they took it off YouTube, but they they called him King of Africa. So he was trying to I think put a whole bunch of Africa unite Africa together and basically say F America, and that's why they took his ass out. That's why they're taking that Medina Jet. That's why they're taking all these people out. And, um, and, look at this site here. And, uh, and Chuck. Nuts and nuts is the And Chuck. That's a nut job you're talking to right there. That's your people? That motherfucker right there is a nut job. You can tell them all that shit. You can tell them a nut job. You can tell them all that. That nigga's a nut job right there. You can tell them all that. Sex offender, too. Uh, no, he can tell them all that. All right, y'all smiling and shit. Tell you that nigga's a sex offender. You can tell them all that. Uh, China and uh, Russia signed you off. You already proved sex offender? China and China and Russia signed off to not take American currency no more, man. And uh, America didn't like that too much at all. Oh, this looks like a Kodak moment. <laughs> you can talk about that. Hey, you can take my picture. I don't give a fuck. You can take my picture, shit. I'm strong in this. Nuts, nuts. <laughs> <You> fucking asshole. <laughs> What did he do to him, yeah? I didn't do he's pissed off because he used to come in my house. He used to come in my house. I never raped nobody. Yo, I didn't rape nobody. He called me the sex. I ain't ever raped nobody. This motherfucker comes in my house. And I used to live in Isla in my house. Cursed out my fucking little ass dog. And he was a, he was a fucking cocker spaniel man. Or kill that motherfucker. Da -da -da -da. So I stood up to him about it. My brother fought him and, and busted his lip. You know, he gonna see me again and I'm gonna hear the same shit, but ain't gonna stop me from getting the word of God and stuff like that. That's a devil right there. Yeah, he was, he was, he was possessed. He definitely was. Uh, he calls all assholes, all nut jobs. Hey man, He's the fucking nut that's job. that. That's a good yeah, thing though. They're supposed to call us. Tongue. They're supposed to call us nuts. <laughs> they're supposed to call us. See, when we out here, people are supposed to. That people is, are not yeah. supposed to like us. They're supposed to say this. Supposed to say that. As long as they don't touch you. Now, if you would have came out the car, you would have got fucked up. See, but people supposed to pe people supposed to talk shit, like calling you a nut job and all that. Hey, man, that's all right. People call us nut. They call us crazy. Well, that's good though. That's good because they call the Lord that. And that's why they crucify the Lord because everybody didn't love the Lord. So they're gonna try to take us out. They're gonna call us terrorists. They're gonna try to do something and try to put hands on us. And that's when God's gonna intervene. Could have been doing anything else. He had his rent like that. The spirit after, yeah. You know, that wasn't him. That was that that, that 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 demon on him. And really think about it. it if he was serious and wanted to do something, he would have came out the car. There's five of us here. He would have got stomped out. See, Jake just talks a lot of shit. They don't know who the fuck they talking to. They don't know what you have on you. Jake just talks shit. But there's gonna come a time where a lot of our people gonna get fucking killed, man. And he, he, the Lord gonna deal with him. Cause you know what, we might be men of the Lord and the Lord gonna fucking deal with him and his family. What's that scripture? Uh, fishers and hunters. And he says sex offenders. First of all, this guy got demons on him. You could rape a woman in the scriptures. I I'm gonna tell you, no, but I'm gonna tell, no, no, I'm gonna tell you the truth. I'm gonna tell you the truth. In the scriptures, you can actually rape a woman, but it's not rape. See, the white man don't put that in our mind, our people's mind. You rape a woman, you just leave her. No, in the scriptures, and back in the ancient when you want a woman, you grab the woman, you lay with her, and that became your wife, and you take care of her. But this white man, he's a fucking rapist. Look what the white man did. Look what the goddamn white man did. Didn't the white man rape? The white man raped and killed, man. The white man raped our people. He killed our people. He chopped the noses off the Native American Indians. He raped the black woman. 
He fucking uh, took Taino, Puerto Rican. That's why a lot of Puerto Ricans got their head up the white man's ass. They don't know the truth. They forgot. They used to cut pregnant, pregnant women's, uh, take pregnant women, hang them upside down, cut their stomachs open and step on the baby. The white man did that. He's the number one rapist, man. So you got this guy talking shit. Why does he won't talk like that to the white man? But he wants to come talk shit to us. That's why a lot of our people real soon, man. When that time comes, we're gonna kill a lot of our people, man. The law gonna kill out the law gonna kill his people, he's gonna use us, man. And the word rape means the um, yeah. the, the rob still. It doesn't mean a sexual act when you like, you know what I'm saying? Right. It, it means like ravage. Like you know, matter of fact. When you uh, at the war, what, what did the men do? They went and they ravaged the women. That's that's called booties. <laughs> so you know they call it rape, man. They don't know what they talking about, really. But uh, what I was gonna bring out was, you know, I said that uh, Jake talk a lot of shit and they don't do shit. And you know, we sit back because right now it's not that time. Yeah, for, yeah. Put hands on people. Yeah. Like, that's that's how I saw that niggas do. No, he did a good thing. My language. That's no, 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 that's the truth, brother. Hey, but they're supposed to do that. No, that's nuts and all. Man, we heard everything. We done got them fights and everything. New York, but that's where the elders are. We used to be in New York, get fights over there. We almost had altercations here. It happens, and we get put to death. So what? But we get put to death doing this work. We definitely gonna get a crown on our heads. So it ain't nothing. What are these people gonna do? The majority of people gonna die in here. When this nuclear destruction comes, the majority of our people gonna get left here. So who the fuck are these people? They don't know. They don't know what's about to happen. 2012, the end of the world. The end of the world is coming. The whole world ain't gonna end, but the missiles. There's gonna be a cleansing time, man. That's gonna be the missiles. So fuck these people, man. Straight up. This is Jeremiah 16. Wow. 16. Behold, I was sent for many fishes, says the Lord. Right. And, and, uh, and they shall fish them. Right. And that's what we're doing. We fishing right now. We out here fishing, like the Lord said. I will make you fishers of men, you know? And we out here, we fishing, we gonna get bad fish, we gonna get good fish, you know what I mean? And that's what we doing. I'm, I'm gonna get going, it's good to right. talk to you, brother. Yo, be safe, man. Remember, you you, you a Judite, man, you a Israelite. Yeah. Remember that, yo. Just keep I that in mind. You brothers, man. Right, man. What's in that fag, man? <laughs> well, next Sunday, man. And after, I will send for many hunters, and they shall hunt them from every mountain and from every hill, and out of out of the holes of the rocks. Right, and that's what we doing. That's what we gonna do. We gonna hunt, man. We gonna hunt all you scoffers, all you silly bitches. <coughs> we gonna hunt, hunt, hunt the kings of the earth, the princes of the earth. We gonna hunt all of them. Everybody that is on the hit list. Whoever doesn't have the mark. We gonna hunt our own people, man. We gonna clean our house first. What's that? Uh, Ephesians. Uh, just start at my sanctuary. Yeah, it's gonna start at our sanctuary, man. The Lord, the Lord. We can't have no two thirds hanging out while we cleaning up. You gotta clean your house up before you start cleaning the other people's houses up, man. Kidding, guys like that, man. They just gonna get fucked up, man. That nigga, yo. That I was, I was in, I'm that. in the mellow spirit today, man. We we're coming on the day, man. I'm telling you, man. The time gonna come real soon. How much fucking anger we got, man? How much right. anger we fucking got? It's unbelievable, and that's not enough. The Lord got some serious anger, man. Our people had no respect, and he knew the truth. Lost tribe. That proves that this is going out, man. Oh, the lost tribes. He said Mocking lost the tribe. tribe. Huh. Looking like he a said, fucking Look milk dud. A nut talking to some nuts. Oh, yo. Oh, that man. <laughs> yo, that motherfucker was mad. Hey, he was mad. Like, Word. for a reason. Mad as hell. day's fire ruined right now. Word. He's mad. He, probably, he still thinks about this shit. And <laughs> nobody's going back and forth with him. What are you going to do with a guy like that? Yeah, we just. He's, that's why I said, yeah, keep smiling. Yeah, you trying to take a fight, you know? Yeah, pick a fight in the van. Come outside, <laughs> motherfucker. You got something? Nah, nah. You got something? Yeah. This is uh, Corinthians 1 and... Uh, Corinthians 4... 1 Corinthians 4 and 9. For I think that God has set forth us the apostles last as we are appointed to death. Right. For we are made... For we are made a spectacle unto the world and to angels and to men. Right. We, we are a spectacle, man. People stare at us. People laugh at us, point at us, talk shit to us for no reason. I mean, some people come up sincerely, but nonetheless, we are a spectacle. This cat was sincere right here. Yeah, <coughs> no, you should, I watched him. He was walking by, had his earphones on, and he turned around and he saw that picture and he took one earphone off and walked up. That's so, all like, you got, you gotta have something to ask me because you took an earphone off. That's why Satan came like that. <laughs> Yo. Hey, but that's a good sign. That shows that we're doing the right thing. Yeah, I gotta watch that. I gotta watch that. That motherfucker's wild. We are fools for Christ's sake, but ye are wise in Christ. Right. We are fools for Christ's sake, but we are wise in Christ, man. We'll, te we'll, teach, we'll teach you some... Whatever you need to know out these scriptures, man, we'll teach you, man. But, you know, it, it, we look foolish to the, to the untrained mind, you know? 
Like that man, he, he called us a nut. He just called us nuts. Like a nut talking to some nuts. I don't know what, what man came to nuts. I guess the garment, I don't know. How are we nuts? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. But because we're doing something that, that, that you don't have the balls to do. But that was Lord chose us. We fools. We fools. For, for how we shot, sick, yo. We are weak, but ye are strong. Ye are honorable, but we are despised. Mm -hmm. Nah, that's it. That's it. Yeah, Ezekiel thirty-seven. Up from the top. Ezekiel chapter thirty-seven.